Well, I finally got uh, freaking Green Dot to uh, send me a freaking card at my unverified Curly Jack Road address. It's kind of silly. I don't know, man. Fucking, we live out here in God's country, and uh, everybody gets their... Uh, how long has it been since there's been uh, home delivery, Gary? I don't know, all the time. 20, 30 years. Has there ever been home delivery? Yeah, there has. I think sometimes. I can't remember. 70s? Cut off because of federal bullshit. Federal money. Ah, uh, fucking. Uh, and now the they're all acting like. Uh, the uh, post office is in jeopardy of uh, being lost because they're routing fucking uh, the mail through Reading. It's like, no, man, that's the fucking advance of fucking uh, the postal system. Which may make the postal system obsolete. So, but we'll still have a postal system because that's a mandate of uh, the Constitution. You know, if they get rid of the postal service, uh, you know we live in a uh, communist de facto uh, regime. But uh, this here is the uh, rocket stove that uh, is a uh, group project that uh, is uh, keeping us uh, pretty... Pretty warm now that we've gotten some wood. But, um, pretty miraculous little stove. Everybody, I've, I've had two or three offers of stoves, but uh, it was more expedient to fabricate this stove with $50 and, uh, not only that, but uh, make a uh, freaking uh, oven. Yeah, check this out. Freaking oven. And uh, makes us wheat rolls, cookies. Originally designed for bread, but we might have to make a bigger one. Because, uh, uh, we can't do pizza pies in here, but it's burning pretty, uh, pretty tame. Ooh, this one's. See, these are two different fire, uh, cab or uh, fire boxes separated, so you can only be burning at one side, and not have to burn twice the fuel to get uh, half the heat. But anyway, just wanted to share with you. Um, some of these uh, value cards that uh, I can accept uh, value in um, American Express, Bluebird, the Green Dot, the Net Spend, and uh, I don't know that PayPal, um, Connor Lock. <laughs> yeah, Connor Lock cards. Don't be guessing. But anyway. So we're burning fur, which we're just chopping up and uh, burning trash. <clears throat> and today I finally went and did some laundry, uh, cleaned up. So uh, I don't know, that's kind of what's going on here recently. These fines and these white boots. up a bicycle. Uh, and, uh, I don't know. It's an evolution in progress. But what were we just uh, talking about uh, doing down here, guys? 1600 1600 in this room. Mm. Well, uh, there's been out east that would, uh, I'm for sure be interested in 
pledging to uh, turn that project into a reality. Um, 1,600 plants. Um, when I was the head grower at the uh, Church of <clears throat> Tree of Life Church in Albuquerque, New Mexico, um, we had a grow there with like six, seven hundred plants. So I can see sixteen hundred plants here in this room, and not um, um, lit by uh, uh, high intensity discharge lamps per se, like we're, we're used to, um, more like, uh, uh, headlamps, uh -huh. which are about 80. I found some bulbs that are 80, uh, or 80 watts. Uh, look at that thing. Is that like blingy or what? Is it saying fool's gold? Fool's gold, fool's gold. Drill purdy though. And uh, look at that. That's really cool. And then uh, some little beads just acquired here a few seconds before I start shooting. I love my uh, love my rocks, but um. So yeah, and what we'll be doing is uh, raising um, the final amounts that we need to uh, uh, close on the property and acquire it for um, the public body. So, Gary White, you always say that uh, you miss the gold rush, man. Yeah. That, um, you know, you, uh, you lament that you didn't buy property before. So, well, no, dude, that, I mean, that was the eighties, dude. Yeah. And that, um, you know, is something that, um, um, not everybody was able to take advantage of, even though you might've lived here because you still had to be credit worthy, you know? Yeah. And, um, you know, appease the bankers. And pay them their 20, 22 percent fucking um, interest. Because yeah. that's what everybody neglects to fucking mention about those go go 80 days. <laughs> the fucking prime rate was 22 percent, dude. And people were buying real estate uh, with mortgages like that, dude. Yeah. So, all kinds of crazy shit can happen when uh, demand and. Uh, uh, greed, uh, meat. So anyway, um, we, we gotta get the lights back on. Yeah. Uh, we need, uh, uh to buy a, an, an inverter, um, a generator. I blew up the generator. I, uh, uh, must admit that, um, and Gary, he needs, a uh, uh, uh Propane, uh, 16 uh, ounce uh, uh, propane bottles because uh, he doesn't like the uh, gasoline stove that uh, runs on gasoline, which we usually have around. But the propane bottles uh, also serve another purpose. So. Blowing glass, yeah. cleaning up pipes, um, soldering. So, yeah, what we're going to do instead of uh, using uh, male halide high pressure sodium is we're going to go with these uh, LED lights. Because uh -huh. we can get. I mean, just like this 600 string right here, I'm gonna get for um, I can get from China for about eight bucks. 300 string like this, um, a little bit cheaper. Um, 
maybe like six bucks, five bucks, three bucks, maybe. Even. And it makes uh, these are uh, I think these are indoor, so that means that they don't have the silicone looking uh, plastic. But uh, we're gonna deck it out. We're gonna get rid of the old uh, fluorescent fixtures. Try to sell them off. Some chump that wants to uh, take on that liability. I think that's why we got like an eight hundred dollar um, electric bill. Mostly, it's from all the fluorescent bulbs in the place that illuminate the place. So, yeah. $800 uh, electric bill, $600 phone bill. And um, uh, I think we're going to pay this stuff off by the end of the month. We're going to do some good business. We're going to have an outstanding holiday. And uh, we're going to keep un unearthing uh, treasures like this from the Sea yeah. Camp building. Check this out. What carrier is that right there? Oh, that's uh, the one, I guess that's the carrier that uh, Prince was on. You know, because... It's not a U.S.? Pardon me? It's not a U.S. carrier? Yeah, it is. It's like a, um, it's like a baby carrier. Because they had, uh, there's like a couple different carriers back in World War II. Yeah. Um, they had auxiliary carriers and... Um, Light carriers, um, like the Enterprise, Lexington, Constitution, Constitution, um, freaking or no, uh, Constellation. What year is that? Constitution was that what? Constitution was old Ironside. That's a, a, a frigate that we uh, pilfered from the English. The Bonham mate was formerly known as the. Bonhomme Richard? Yeah. Captain John Paul Jones was the skipper of that uh, command. And uh, so made the uh, Constitution uh, gave her her nickname, Old Ironside, because uh, iron... Uh, Cannonballs used to bounce off her sides. Made her very formidable in uh, standing off uh, uh, naval engagements of the time. But we had a, uh, some of the best uh, uh, Marines in the world. Yeah, the Marine Corps was our main uh, weapon. Uh, of uh, that we wielded with a devastating uh, effect on the British, the Barbary pirates, French, Spanish, whoever fucking got in our way. World's finest Navy, United States Navy. But uh, I work for the real Republic now, you know? Most people go through, like, you know, um, a real uh, identity crisis when they find out that uh, there's a wizard behind the uh, uh, curtain. And he's all like, don't mind the man behind the curtain, you know. And, uh, you know, this is... Uh, piece of art that came with the place and uh, I tell people that I'll take $10,000 for it. Um, is that the real value worth of the painting? I think so, fucking sitting on this wall. But uh, I've even gotten an offer to buy this, this hardware. So, but I don't want to sell these things. I mean, these are iconic things that give the mercantile its character, right? Yeah. yeah. So, I mean, we can't just like, and like Laura, she would like uh, to uh, 
demolish the C Camp building, which is going to be 150 years old in 2015. She would just like to uh, dis dismantle it for $30,000 that the bricks would fetch. What do you say? To, what do you think about that? She just wants money, man. Fucking bitches. But uh, thank goodness I, I have different plans and Sea Camp building will not turn into a brick fucking pile for a pile of fiat money. But, um, yeah, so, you know, we're using some uh, LED lamps out here. This is a total freaking mess. But um, we're cleaning it up. We're changing it up. We're going to get it open by first. Regular hours, right? Regular hours. But, um, yeah, it's the mercantile. Still doing business at 2nd and Indian Creek. Hardware. Apparel. Electrical. Plumbing. Oh my god, and even freaks of uh, yesteryear. TVs. Mannequins. Oh my god. And uh, who knows what else. What you'll find where. After Gary runs through here and Uh, yeah, rearranges everything to what his uh, uh, scheme, which is just fine with me for right now because I, I don't know what the hell we're doing. We're just trying to clean up and uh, keep things going. But anyway, hey, that's what's going on in the mercantile. 20th of December 2014 in the district of Happy Camp Republic, state of Jefferson.